comes on the inside. Nelson drifts a little bit high. We're just about three wide out of quarter number four. Chuck Butcher in the lead. Miss Nelson back in second. Zabraski third. Moss in fourth. And in fifth, the 41, Larry Zeller. Five of the toughest, the toughest. Five of the top guards here at the track. All in front of it for their heat. And uh, this is going to be a good one. Right now, Mr. Fletcher, that front left tire off the ground most of the time. Don't have to worry about that wearing out too fast. Back in second still, Dustin Nelson with 46, Shane Zabraski the 7 8. He's trying to creep up on the inside. Not really trying to move uh, the 46 over, Dustin over or anything, but he's just sticking that nose down there little by little, lap by lap, and trying to get up around Dustin Nelson. Wow, Fletcher in the lead. We're side by side with Shane Zabraski now moving up, getting in front of the 46 car of Dustin Nelson. Dave Moss. He's in third right now, side by side with Dustin Nelson. Right now it's still the number 26 car in the lead. These guys are not messing around, folks. Putting these laps together in a hurry. It's Fletcher in the lead. Zabraski back in second. Moss in third. Nelson in fourth. And Larry Zeller, the 41 in fifth. Larry now comes up on the inside, trying to move his way around the number 46 of Dustin Nelson. The white flag already out. We've got just one left to go. No dilly dally on this one at all, folks. Half a lap to go. It's still Fletcher in the lead. Zabraski back in second and Moss third. Here we go. Corner number four. Zabraski on the inside. Get on. We'll see what happens. Caution light is off. Brandon Riedemann looks him over. Green flag in hand. He says, guys, you can't get it much better than that. Let's put him to the green. Well, the 46 car, just in the A strike out of Elk River on the outside. Now he brings it down sort of mid-track, but our lead car at this point, Dave Payne, in the 2C. At the number 24, he started second row back on the inside. He's currently in that second position with the 46 and just an A strike out of Oak River back in third. So Martini has moved up a spot. Dave Gaines says, Ben, I draw a good number. I'm going to do my best to hold on to it. But watch the number 24, Eric Martini, reeling him in lap by lap, just a little bit at a time. Right now, the number 69 car, Justin Jones, out of Bemidji. He gets up around the 46, then the 46 back to down the rack to just about passing him again. That's exactly what happened. Justin Jones goes a little bit high, gets up on top of the cushion, and that lost him dearly. Let's look back to our leaders. Right now, they're coming up the the 2C, our lead car by about a car length and a half with Eric Martini, the 24, back in second. In third place, the number 46, Justin A. Strike out of Elk River. He's at half a lap back. In fourth place, the number 69, Justin Jones. Green flag is out. You got it, folks. That means we have just uh, two more laps to go. Here we go. White flag coming out for Mr. Dane Kane and the 2C and Eric Martini. They have separated themselves from the rest of the field by pretty much a half a lap. White flag out for the last guard. Here we go with the checker. Who is it at the line? Dane Kane, the 2C with the win. Little Red Wagon Child Care 41, Larry Zeller from Maple Grove will start ninth and on the outside, Brandon Hines about two weeks deep into the Modifieds. It is the original Prano Pump, Accurate Automotive 25 of Brandon Hines from Becker, and we're going green. Green flag is out for the Modified A, man, is scheduled for 20 laps, they're three wide down the back chute. The 2C of Dave Kane moves up to the front. 46, Dustin Nelson, Dan Fletcher in 26, run 1, 2, 3. 24, Eric Martini, 7A, Sobraski, and the 2 of Dave Moss. Dave Kane in 2C as Jones takes a quick right off of turn number 3. The caution is out. Justin Jones in 2C as we get ready for the green flag on the restart. We're back in action, so right in front of the grandstand, some interesting activity. But we maintain the green flag. 2C, Dave Kane, 46, Dustin Nelson. The car's starting to get stretched out just a little bit. 24, Eric Martini in 7A. Zabraski goes to work in turn three. He's up on the cushion, brings it back down right next to 24. Martini, who now sits fourth. Dave Moss into 
Martini in third, and Dustin Nelson, 46, will round out the top four spots. Well, race fans, there you have it, your last entry into the Mossman Geothermal and Mechanical Victory Lane. The driver from Corker, and it's Dave Kane in 2C. He's sponsored by Brandel Motors, Ibox Springs, Outlaw Wrap, Speedworks, Corker and Loggers, Champion Oil. AFCO Racing Products, Newman Enterprises, Weir's Machine, Mountain Manufacturing, Kane Farms, Bob Harris Enterprises, Ray's Auto Body, JRI Shocks, Justice Brothers, and Bassett Racing Wheels. As he's the final entry into the Mossman Geothermal Victory Lane here tonight at Princeton Speedway. We'll get him out of the car for the trophy presentation. Race fans, your winner. In the modifieds tonight, 20 laps the distance. He started on the pole, never looked back. The rest of the competitors battling hard behind him in positions two, three, four, and beyond. Let's get Dave Kane out of the car. Race fans, it'll be a chance for you one more time to put your hands together. Your feature winner in the Modifieds climbing out in victory lane. Let's hear it for Dave Kane in 2C.